Buses lined the curb, cars filled the lot, and teachers cheered on their students. Kicking off a big day for the Elm City. After over a year of online learning, students, parents, and faculty all anxiously awaiting this moment, the moment for their children to get back in the classroom. Oh, we are super excited. I felt like it was literally the first day of school. New Haven High School students will be operating under a hybrid model, meaning one cohort of students learn in the classroom Mondays and Tuesdays, and the other cohort on Thursdays and Fridays, with Wednesday reserved for online learning. We've been waiting for this day. We've been planning for this day. For freshman destiny, this moment brings up feelings of joy, excitement, but also nerves. It's like my first year, so it's really nerve wracking for me. Her first year of high school was granted a different start than the typical freshman experience given the pandemic, but she's looking forward to meeting her teacher and getting that hands on learning experience in the classroom. I'm the type of person that likes to do in person, so online was very hard for me. Principal Johnson says this is a step in the right direction for the kids since they missed out on so much throughout the past year. We have a lot of ground to catch up on. As a principal, my number one job is to make sure that your children are safe. One Step, a Yale-based organization, works to connect New Haven youth with critical resources and mentors to help students stay active and engaged in school and in the community. Having a place to go in general is always is always great, and this is a safe environment, and people like us, like One Step, just want to help them um, get with as many resources as they, they can. All efforts working to provide a quality and normal education for these kids. Lauren Zenzi, Fox 61 News.